Good morning, Colorado. Welcome to a Thursday edition of Local Biz Buzz. I'm your host, Larry Hers, and today in studio, I have Paul from Switch Vodka. Welcome, Paul. Thank you. So, those, you really don't know what I drink because I don't drink much on these shows, but I'm a vodka guy. And then when I saw these vodkas uh, on Instagram, I'm like, oh my God, look at that. That is so cool. I have to try it. So here he is. I'm going to be trying these vodkas this morning. Uh, give me a little history of Switch Vodka. Sure, absolutely. So uh, Switch Vodka was actually created, um, me and three of my buddies grew up here in Colorado and essentially um, created a distillery called 5280 Distilling. Uh, and started with some you know, original products from that and then really got to the point where we felt like we needed something more Colorado. Well, you know, we're big hikers, campers, boaters, um, that type of thing. And we wanted something indestructible. We wanted something almost healthy, as it were. Uh, and we came up with Switch Vodka. Okay. And ultimately, we came to the conclusion that we wanted it to be tough as nails and to be able to get cold immediately. So created, we created this liter bottle. Uh, and essentially it's a, it's a hundred percent recyclable. It comes in a liter. It's full aluminum. So it cools down immediately. Uh, we had some buddies who took it camping. Uh, they forgot ice. They just set it in the river Oh, nice. and, 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 like and it cooled down like that. Uh, put it in the freezer. It'll turn into a slushy. But, uh, so the, the packaging itself is very unique. Uh, it's, it's very strong. And, and as far as the alcohol, uh, it's going to be very smooth. Probably one of the smoothest vodkas you're ever going to try. Uh, part of that is our distillation process. Uh, we have what's known as an eye still. Uh, yeah, so I, I, I went to the opening of 5280 Distillery, and, and they're like, you got to come check out the still. And I'm like, why, why do I need to check right. it out? Right. <laughs> but it, it's a big deal, the still. The it is still. pretty neat. Yeah, it is. You know, your traditional copper kettle, which is what most distillation yeah. processes are done on, is it's, it's great. It's fantastic. But our, our, um, our motto is very much old world tradition, new school technology. Okay. Uh, and this still, it's 100% stainless steel. It's actually connected to the internet. Uh, so we can monitor it nice. from home, which is great because we have families. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, uh, but it really allows for you know, good, precise, clean cuts of all of our alcohol. Uh, and that's what created these. These are zero sugar, zero sugar, even, even the ones that are flavored. Uh, and we use all natural fruits. Uh, so zero sugar. Uh, very, very low calorie. You can do under 90 calorie cocktails all day long with these. Compared to regular vodka? Compared to regular vodka. What, yeah. what, how many calories would be in regular vodka? That's a good question. You know, you're, some vodkas per serving anywhere from, you know, they can go all the way up above, you know, 150, 200 calories. Okay. So almost um, so half. We could, yeah, we could pretty much half it. And right. there's still some good, healthy, lower calorie vodkas out there too. Go ahead. Yeah. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna start drinking. Yeah, get make you, sure you, you get some notes on that one. Yeah, get some, this is our peach basil. So we actually use fresh Palisade peaches oh, that smells from really Palisade. Good. Doesn't that smell good? Uh, from Palisade, obviously. Uh, and we do what's called a vapor uh, infusion. Imagine like a, almost like a giant cheesecloth, and we fill it with real Palisade peaches and real basil from Colorado, and it hangs under the column of our eye still and the heat actually creates a vapor that infuses the alcohol. Is that the craziest thing you've ever heard? Yeah. Cheers, everybody. I'm going to try this one. Yep, give that a whirl. Um, you'll get good, flavorful peach and then a hint of basil. Yeah, smooth. And that's straight, right? And it's healthy. And it's healthy. It's healthy drinking. It's, and it really is. I mean, the other thing, too, is, is with the concept is, you know, say there's, you know, White Claw and Truly and all the seltzers are kind of blowing up now. Um, you would need roughly 18 White Claws to match the alcohol content of this. And if you're going hiking or backpacking, that's kind of hard to carry. You know, going playing some disc golf, going golfing, you just grab one of these and you've got 18 white claws. So you, you and your buddies are set. I, mean, I, I like it fine. I'm a, I drink my vodka on the rocks, but I could see, you know, for people who don't like it that strong, just add some soda water and you got a beautiful cocktail. Beautiful cocktail, exactly. Um, and if you want to get a little more creative, people love a little bit of lemonade. Like a like a peach vodka it. lemon. So I'm gonna let you try this one. Is our light spirit drink, which essentially we call it a pure vodka. It's a straight vodka. What's great about this one? This is what we call the universal mixer. Um, so what I mean by that is anything you mix this with, <laughs> we got a whole liter to work with. <laughs> like I haven't. Which is great. It's bigger than the 750. I, I, I do have more work to do. <laughs> but give this a whirl. So you're about to try straight vodka at you know 9:30 in the morning, uh, and you're gonna be fine. Yeah, the only thing I would put in it is 
Maybe a squeeze a lime? Yeah, whatever. Yeah, exactly. Squeeze a lime, keep it fresh. Um, as far as mixers, that's what's great. Whatever you have on hand, this light spirit drink, this pure vodka, it'll go with it. All right, next what? one. Last but not least. Very intriguing. So this is our pomegranate lemongrass. And, and are you making it that same method? Exact same method. Real pomegranate. Somehow real vapors. lemongrass. Yep. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> yep. Magic. It's magic yeah. how they make this. Uh, and essentially, if, if we're not getting the full flavor profile that we'll need, we'll take a little of the essential oils from the pomegranate and the lemongrass and add it in there as well. Okay. So this one, by nature, pomegranate's going to be a little more subtle. Uh, but you're almost getting antioxidants with your vodka. I mean, I like your sales pitch here. We're going to convince people why this is over. That, uh, you this, can literally bike is, all day <laughs> and drink this vodka. This is healthy drinking. Uh, getting your fruits in. Yeah. Um, so the peach one is, is amazing. Yep. Yeah, it was a 10. And this one is subtle. I was hoping I'd get... Yeah. Uh, that one I've found people are doing with flavored club sodas. Uh, like a bubbly. Buble. <laughs> like a flavored bubbly. That yeah. type of thing. They'll do that. Um, yeah. I, and, was, I would definitely drink that too though. I mean, don't yeah. worry. Yeah. <laughs> what we found is... Folks will buy this one, and they're like, that's amazing. Yeah. Uh, and then they'll move to this one. They're like, ooh, that's a fruity one as well, but maybe not quite as fruity. And then they're like, what is this one? Oh, wow, that's a straight vodka. And once they've realized that they can have a low-calorie cocktail in these, they'll move on to this one as well. Now, I've been out to your tasting room, but because of COVID, there's no more tasting room. For a little while, yeah. Yeah, but where can people buy your, your vodkas? So we are in over roughly 160 liquor stores, and if you go to switch-vodka.com, uh, there's a map. Uh, but if you're in the Denver metro area, you know, we're in Tipsy's, we're in Lucas Liquor, we're in Argonaut downtown. If you're in downtown, we're in Davidson's Liquor. Uh, we just got into Molly's Liquor, both right. over by Lakeside right. and right. over right. here, right. Bevy's. So all of your major carriers, if they don't have it, go ask for it. And then approximately, <laughs> what, would that, what would it cost in those stores? You know, depending on the liquor store and their margins, anywhere between 23 bucks mm -hmm. uh, and 25 bucks. But you get more alcohol than regular. You really are. That's what's fantastic. You're getting a liter of alcohol. It, it, it's interesting because it looks smaller than your standard glass 750, but that's because it's aluminum. Yeah. Uh, but you're getting 250 more milliliters um, than what you would normally get. And, you know, when hopefully things do open back up, anywhere you used to not be able to take a glass container, you know, like a concert, things like that. And in mm -hmm. concerts, they kind of check it. But anywhere you couldn't take a glass container, cool. like the beach, the pool, you can take this. Brilliant. Yeah. Uh, and then since you're here, we're going to talk yep. about your whiskeys yep. too. Yes, since we're here. So Switch is essentially its own brand, but it is distilled and bottled by us at 5280 Distilling. We also have a fantastic bourbon. It's known as a Cackler's bourbon. Um, extremely smooth, almost like a honey caramel finish. This is going to be roughly... 34 to 39 dollars at the liquor store so to get a quality craft colorado bourbon for that kind of price uh, and then we also have an irish rye this is our hearthstone irish this is a three-year-old irish we actually import from dublin and then redistill in house um, if you're a jameson fan try this because this is five levels up not that there's anything wrong with Jameson. it's good stuff it's delicious um but this is going to be a good colorado version Jameson right? is a crazy thing in that it's been around forever it is great no, stuff i'm a big jamo fan <laughs> nobody drank it forever yeah and then it exploded and then yeah how why how yeah does that stuff happen i don't know you know hopefully it happens with our stuff right <laughs> uh but very much you know if if you if you dig a good whiskey um it's just a little bit peaty uh, and then a, and a hint of like oak and vanilla on the end. So those are our two whiskeys. And then these vodkas, man, especially with snowboard skiing season around the corner. I mean, throw it in your backpack, take it on the hill, have, you know, have a little picnic, have a cocktail in the snow. And you set this in the snow, it's, it's going to be cold long. four minutes. <laughs> four minutes. You leave it in the snow for 30 minutes, you're going to have a slushy. You'll have a peach basil slushy. Uh, so really, it is just truly a quintessential, uh, you know, Colorado vodka. I would encourage folks to... Go to maybe Switch Vodka, switch-vodka.com, or our Facebook page and watch the commercial. Because the commercial is fantastic. It's hilarious. All right. It's a very funny it commercial. Yeah, it's great. Uh, thank you so much for coming in, Paul. Yeah. Good to meet you. Thanks for having us. Uh, we'll see you today at 1130. We have uh, Nessio on What's for Lunch. Uh, great Mexican food. And that is episode 98. So we got episode 100 coming up on Monday with Troy Gard coming in. Big deal for that on Monday. And I'm uh, going to be drinking all day. So let's drink. <laughs>